a bit too early, but now they execute on the side. Ah, they do execute on the side, and they pretty much get the room for free. Akuma is not quite sure if he shall gravitate towards that spot, not at all, and so... Logan gazes down the gun barrel, makes it a man advantage right here for NIP. SBDS also have a 2 HP rotated on them. Surely he could still put the dart down, but this is forcing Rhyme out, doesn't it? Uh, I'm not quite sure if he does. Nope, not at all. Doesn't have a blast pack as well to get him out of there. And here comes the dart for information. This clears it out. Everybody should be pretty much spotted if it wouldn't have been destroyed in time. And so they try. Akuma finds a coup cause, and this leads to a defense that is by the book or not. That is the question. Timer's ticking, and he's ticking down. Down and down and down. Hoppy will still try with the one taps, but Chihuahua. My sources. <laughs> For a second, I thought. <laughs> because the funny thing is that I recently tweeted exactly that. <laughs> so funny. Oh, did you? Yes. Exactly. Creeping up on backside. Look at that. Oh, no. He's Hoppy got cuts the kill, but oh. he will get backstabbed by Wait Chihuahua. That's my guess, but what is happening here? No in clue. double dose. Oh, and the secrets are out. I mean, Akuka spots it and out. And well, Chihuahua has nothing to really stop that. He can just try to wide swing, tack the first, needs to find the diffuser. Does he do so? Well, it's Hop, and he goes for every single duel. The young Russian strikes. First one down, second one as well, but the slaughter has not went by Logan. And this is the moment where NIP. Do they go? Oh my god, yeah, there they go. By Roden. Yeah, deja vu. I have a little deja vu for sure and right now you see that all of this is collapsing right here akuma comes in as they were trying to come from the sidelines no Play chance and cray up a little late to the party that's for sure tied up the same movement speeds he can't dash around and he will be pretty much taken out that's the operator out of play but the cosmic divide couldn't make a difference well Pretty much for now, you can't pass it that easily. Rodan is taking left. a different stance. Chihuahua and Rodan might just kiss any second oh, soon. Time. Look how close they are. Oh, that's so awkward. He saw the dart. Oh. He must have noticed the dart. No way. And it's Rodan who closes it out. Oh, that is so. And that flash. Man's blind. Can't dash oh. away. Oh, oh, no way. It's oh, the Belgian. Oh, the smoke. And the dash was there to save him, but not really. Not this time. Oh, oh my god. Really no words for that. Kukos yeah. with the two kills. Huge kills to open up the round. This should not have looked like this so no. far. And you know, we talked about in the pre-show, man had an injury. Man is usually not the entry fragger for their side, but here they come and they One seem to capitalize remaining. on just a few sheriffs. Started off with a Kukos beheading nobody else than Jet. And as he still falls, Akuma is still there! Hold your phone! What in God's name is that from Akuma? As he still tries to come around at one point... One in this. Could have been awkward. Imagine the plans are having 30 HP instead of Rhyme. Yeah. Uh, That'd be crazy. Team kill right here. Not something you often see in, in Valorant. Nope. But it is a retake. Four versus five. Mm -hmm. So there's this divide coming in. And now BDS will try to get the site. Yeah, they will try to get on it. Kreya falls and Akuma is once more chiming in. Chihuahua from the back lines. And that is probably taking a lot of time. He doesn't hear it. He doesn't know about the defuse. You gotta be fast. You gotta be swift. But that is... Uh, and it's a problem. Deficit on, on the defense. Oh, Logan gets spotted by the drone. Okay, never mind. What, what, whatever I was saying uh -oh. is not really important now because the execute falls on C. Yeah, that comes all on C. And suddenly, Akuma got to do it all on his own, but fails against the Kukos. A man was just on 30 points of health. The headshot still did it. And here comes a little tiger. Rodan spotted. Shock dart coming in. And he's the last man standing. We talked about the efficiency with those electrifying darts. This time around, it seems like it could have gotten a Kukos. It ain't enough. Still gonna take the fight against Free. Saw a bit of the shoulder of Rhyme. Still, it's not done yet. And nope, that one. Could have been well. So disciplined and well structured is always a pleasure to watch. And oh my god, Hoppy again! Yeah, you start. First death goes towards ah, BDS. This is not looking good. Three versus four now. They lose so much map control. Exactly sure. Uh, they very much lost a good bit there. Also, right now with Chihuahua getting a lot of information. They decide to go for the A site. The one where BDS is quite good at retaking, actually, but. Road in a low HP, that should make it very easy. At the same time, we see two ults that will pretty much delay this or make it a horrible process. Uh oh, look at Rhyme. He is actually not affected. Oh uh, no. Wait he a is second. not affected. No one will expect that. There you exactly. go. There you go. And Rhyme is pretty much closing the case. A decent points of health, but that was a dink by the book. In the meantime, they still try. Chihuahua gotta hold them up and he will do so. It means Rodan falls in the grave.
The last man standing, 6 to 5. It is. Yeah, they will very much execute on C, though. The amount of ults really could become a problem. In the meantime, Logan's out, and Rodin's gonna continue the party. Still eliminated, not playing by the ults. Could become a problem, could become very uncomfortable, and here are the shock darts for you. Electrifying performance, as in the meantime, Kreyak got the flank, and the sidelines belong to Astra, which definitely makes this a hard retake, because on the way there, on their journey, it should be done and dusted. Now this is gonna be a three versus three retake, and Korea oh, has a massive no. position, absolutely massive position. Let's see how that, that will end up, because right now BDS, they have no idea where everyone is. They can be Heaven, they can be B, they can be Graffiti under Heaven, they can be everywhere. They have to be aware of everything happening. Back they know about him. Superior movement speed just creeps standing. up and gets the head off Chihuahua. Korea dies on B and now JD alone. No utility. 18 seconds of recon. He sees the barrel. He gets the kill. But will he will he survive this? That's the question. He has not too much really to offer right now. Comes around. Can't take the frack. It is tied. And now up to Haven. Two smokes guarding their positions. And now Boombot will try to start a retake. Yeah. And as they start to retake, JD and Rhyme all doing just a superb job. But still, it's they're not done yet. It is is just basically BDS not done yet. Logan could clutch this out. 100 points of health. Don't help the man when he's just being you know, shot in the back of his head by a Kukos. Seven frame for NIP. When he oh. comes. Oh, this is going to be tough to execute for. Ah, and Akukas is really in a horrible spot right now. Spotted, but not eliminated. This deals good damage, and suddenly through the smoke they come. And that is another shock dart on Rodin, but you cannot kill the king of the shock darts. Not that easily, at least. And as they right now try to still hold the control on site, they need to find frags. Otherwise, they will be overrun in the process. Talking about it, Rodin is the last man standing, and the pretty much open spike has now finally found the ground still 38 30 and 100 could be possible but it ain't working yeah the first three seconds peak and getting rhyme off from the boy oh there's a gravity well you love it and there you get sucked in doesn't work and kukas is capitalizing at least on one the other one was just nothing else than a little phoenix salt and this means that kreya Still having a few stars left, ready for action. Coming in with the first airs to gravity well. Sucked in the first. Poor Krayal taken out. Akukos as well. JD on his own. And this means the young Russian got to chime in. Though I very much doubt that this is working. You predicted it. Is it coming that way though? Here's the shock down. Here is nothing else. That's the in for one as well. Oh, and he finds it. Oh, he commits to it. And JD will have the perfect food. Perfect. Yeah. Unless. Uh, unless no, it's the thing. He gets it. Oh, JD, you are nothing else than the personal Grim Reaper of BDS. I'm worried right now that this just might turn sour. First one coming in. Yep, that is going to no one else than Takas, who's, by the way, on one point of health. Get him out of the server. See you next time around. And also, JD is taking him out with his X-Ray. So, pretty easy one. NIP should grab just another round. Ooh, nice shot from Logan, but not good enough. That's about 150 times more powerful than what it was needed. Uh, and by the way, there are rockets that are dealing 149 a lot. But uh, this is the map point for NIP looking really solid right now. Space or even the first blood. It seems like Hobby is just uh, running in. There you go. And look, Chihuahua gets a double. A gets triple, a triple secured from him. That is master class and leaving the garage closed. You don't even touch my Porsche here. Uh -uh, get out of your kids. And as he's looking for that ace, might be just stopped in the process for sure. I mean, a 4K must be more than enough. I remember this gravity well quite well. And so it seems like poor Rodin has to now perform a miracle and he's still trying to strike against way too many ah rhyme is rather moving back want them out of there they don't want them stuck akuma on four all slowed this is a defense by the book they saw the spike now they need to capitalize on all those low hp players don't make that work akuma and rodent strike means that there is a man advantage quite massive here for nip they go all revenge still jd sees one pin slogan down 
And now it's Chihuahua time. Now it's Chihuahua time. Strikes one after another. It's not enough. Gotta swap the pistol. Ain't making that work. But Akuma is still on four points of health. And you can once more fang Cypher. Tip most likely lost for NIP. They had been three versus five. And there was a Sage that was on a cooldown with, uh, with the heal. It, it, this was nuts. It was by the book, really. And, you know, as we see right there, that might just all be countered. Chihuahua just waiting... For all of those steps, the main coming his way. Yeah, oh, that is timing. Oh, no way. He saw just a bit of Hoppy. Still gets punished for it. Unlucky for him. Conversions don't work here. Yeah, I, I, now, such a save by Chihuahua. And they're going to throw uh -oh. this round. Oh! Four guns picked up. Right, uh -oh. or three. But he goes for it. Interesting. Yeah. Uh -huh. He gets a double kill. Now he's 21 HP. Gets two charges on the, on the ultimate. But he can save the Spectre. Now preparing for a push on B, and this is the will question: Will that be enough? Oh no! Five people now running on B. Chihuahua needs to go big. Uh, go big or go does. home? Oh yeah, oh, well, he's getting spent. Might be just, might be just go home soon. But ouch, that's not gonna hit him. Chihuahua stays alive. 18 points of health to make a difference. Is he capable of doing so? Not at all. Akuka's last man standing. Just hears the shots. Get oh no! Oh no! Oh, he still gets one, but it's definitely not worth it. Five damage tripwire from Cypher. Something you don't really see often, especially when it comes to the to the uh, death of someone. But now, the Rolling Thunder counters, but there's the Rolling Thunder to the, to the other counter. But Ryan gets a double oh, kill. Oh, they were concussed. The nade. Yeah, it wasn't even the showstopper. That was all just a big distraction. It was just the pain shells coming in. And that could be finally a second round for NIP. Froden doesn't have too much to say anymore. Logan's chiming in as well. They definitely want the big cake. Not only just one of those slices. And as they're coming for more and more, it's Rhyme ending it. Rhyme is in an awkward uh, spot. He's being drawn and no he's damage. being deep, but no one knows about him. That's wild. Actually, finds Rhoda in the process. I wouldn't have expected that to be the case. But still, it is JD who could try to find a corpse and revive it. At the same time, those dead men are very well guarded. Though, yeah, that cosmic divide coming in, very useful. And that kind of helps, it, right? It does. Bit. You know, it's not your own, but still, it makes it work. And this means Hoppy and Co. could struggle massively to defend that retake. Akuma is still chiming in, and that is Astra at its best, leading JD on his own as he do tries. Ugh, Logan, full HP. Not the easiest one to grab as he baits him. Where you want to be? And Kraya and Co. still looking good old twice. A white swing immediately punished. Does it with any without any assistance? At the same time, probably was just trying to gain information, but mm -hmm. not that way around. Absolutely not. Astro sets up her smokes oh, on no. heaven NCT. Oh, but Akuko's nice flash. Okay. There really you go. Done, but that's <laughs> rhyme with the showstopper. Obviously really nice. gets a frag because that's how it works. And Takas goes in. Doesn't There's get rhyme. Rhyme again uh -huh. with the kill on sight. And now he's the man in the spotlight. Nobody else should be on the stage for the moment. And of course, it's Rhyme for a frag that he gets. And it could be just him closing the chapter. Logan is making a noise. Still punish him right when needed. And this brings it to a one versus one. That someone like Chihuahua is winning. Yep, he does. No, he does. Yeah, wait a second. He does, but Chihuahua still punishing him time. He did. As well as another ult from Akukos. Kriya moving through, but the punishment... No, check your corners. That's what you get. Takas with the absolute <laughs> impact. But then JD pays him a visit. Risk it, they'd rather just take a retake. No. Especially with Chihuahua on the flank, but he fails. But first time we were seeing a Cosmic Divide to retake a spike. But wow, Gakuma with the double kill. What a nasty double headshot. Had to do it. But, oh, there you go. go. Let's feed Takas to some more showstoppers in this game. Let's go. Yeah. Seems like they learned from Scream last time, but amazing stuff coming in. Akukos not bringing it when, even though his opponents were stunned. And this is where we see JD doing JD stuff. If he finds a little more, unfortunately not. Also, this man has some limited abilities. He's not got him. Seen. You can't have it easier. Talking about the first one. Yep. Showstopper's gone. At the same time, it is the spike pretty much brought to them on a pedestal. <laughs> Akukos just escapes magically, if you ask me. He should have never made through that. At the same time, it is the Belgian trying to put his team together. Get a retake going. 
does was a great double peek by NIP, but now JD has to be patient. He needs to wait for his teammates. Like, he's being divided, right? There's no one to help him to get a trade. He's a little bit over eager, already peeking out a little bit from CT. Roden backside, Hoppy behind Pillar, Logan in the garage. There's the turret set up to act as a half of a player. Yeah. Please get some info. They know about the operator. Oh, oh there God, you go. Hobby. Oh, they strike. It's still Chihuahua. 16 points of health, no chance. A half. As the roll. That's oh, disgusting. That's Beautiful so well combination. Done. Uh, oh, oh, Akuma has to make a move. Is immediately taken out. As he does, still takes JD with him. Look at the control that, you know, he thought he would take. Ain't happening. Rhyme and Co. collapse as they tried their best to take and split the entire map into two halves. And so, Logan executed. That's a good start. They're the point where they could turn that one around. But health-wise, not looking ideal. Utility-wise, far away from perfect. Somebody might just come over on the flank. A Kukos and his bro. Player standing. Not them, but three versus one with 47 HP, you're getting triple peaked, double peaked, whatever. That, one, that could have, that's something you don't really see happening. Yeah, that, that was really awkward. And now BDS is very happy about that. Now they have a man advantage. They know that CT is a wall, so they can just push together from all the sides. Oh my god, Chihuahua is, is being caught by the well, but he can't. Oh, so it. strong. Ooh, the double is obviously once more turning this one around. The Kukos and JD, they got the rifles in hand. The Spectres are uncomfortable when you gotta get close range, but here they come. First one granted, second one also coming in from young JD. The man said, you know, everybody can play a duelist. I wanna play a support and perfection at. Here you go. He shows what he's capable of. Half. And suddenly, a ring around the rosy pays off for Akukos. Number 12 for BDS, but NIP still have a say in this. Three fires that little bot. And so, the defender killjoy is now about to be the one that actually gets eliminated. No, it still continues. Oh That's not going to work. NIP are out of this round 100%. Two players detained. And this spike ain't fine. Dismantled by the yeah. lockdown? Like, that's a beautiful setup, but this wouldn't work if there will be more time available for NIP. So you can see like, but it is in an awkward spot. He's being stunned. Oh my God, there's no way you survive. Oh, that's so beautiful. It is, it very much is. But NIP only down to three players. I think you can make it too. And at that point in time, the story should be pretty much told. Chihuahua, the last man standing. They just double swing. They don't care really about the camera. Uh -oh. They just need to get the numbers. There they but come. Ain't yeah, enough. it's so tough, man. It, it, this is also where the Vandal and the Phantom difference... Go. The backs against the... Yeah. Uh, and they oh. push on side. Oh they my. do. Oh, there you go. In a matter of seconds, everything changes. And so Takas and Co. capitalize on a weakened NIP in this attack. As Akukos tries, sucked in, no chance. And so Chihuahua... 34 points of health. I mean, surely, you know, this man can perform miracles. Surely he is a pistol god. Oh. Talking about it. Looking for him. Pushed out of his position because of the paint shots. Oh, there's already the lurk on the elbow, but he gets it. Logan with 40 HP still holds that position. Gets the second Too one again. Easy. Oh, that was Roden with the third kill. He's gonna catch Sova off guard. Oh my god, he knows about it. Misses first shots, but he is on 2 HP. Chihuahua is not happy. He was going for that heal. Now they're gonna play the retake scenario for sure. And they have to. No other option. Rhyme is going out. Oh, and he's just ignoring the existence of Rodan. I mean, that seems absurd. He's pretty much getting it gifted. Thank you very much. Seems like Christmas is coming early for BDS. And Spike was wrapped up. Oh, Jesus. That was a rally back there. Chanceless. Yeah, BDS on point with the timing of the utility and the spacing oh, as so well. Good. Logan gets the first one, doesn't get the second one. Hoppy 30 HP or oh, is going closer a little bit. He sees oh, no. Rhyme, but Rhyme goes on top, literally and figuratively. Yeah. Figuratively. <laughs> well, oh my. Two versus two retake. This is the chance for NIP. They gravitate towards victory, and uh, finally, it could be revitalized NIP getting back into it. Surely they could still be pinpointed towards where they actually are. And Akuma... Oh, no! He reloads at the time! What are you doing, Akuma? Actually taking that one back? JD's still alive! He puts out the divide in a one versus one! The man is absolutely nuts, and he gets punished for that! I do not... Oh, the garden, so he gets the, the, the fuse for free, but uh, such an awkward... Yes, what? what? 
What is happening in this game? Yeah, Logan could just wait. Logan doesn't need to peek. Could just play for his ult. At the same time, man is just going for all the flicks. He's collecting dark tags left, right, and center. And NIP with their pants down. Gotta see how Akukos gets him. Doesn't look like this though. Already, there but we go. Rodan again, with the again. kill, Takas with the kill, but JD and Korea repay with the shares as always. Oh, this is disgusting. That is a free K by the book. But at the same time, and I peep, just line up once more. It's a, it's a beautiful combo, beautiful combo by Logan and Hoppy. Exceptional play, really. I mean, he knows how to set his player. Seen him, but I think it doesn't make a difference. They definitely yeah, go for that side. Alone there. Yep, and you see, here here comes nothing else than once more that very, very crucial bot. Logan still has a lockdown. Just put that thing down and finally yeah, put them away from the it. Xs. And there it goes. Well, three frags are being collected anyway by Rodan. Didn't even need that. Thank you for, well, the mental. So, in the meantime, <laughs> it just came out of nowhere, right? Just pushed through and Rodan was like, wait a second, did I see something? Oh, so nice. But still, ah, I mean, it, it doesn't make a difference, right? But it, <laughs> Ryan, is, you have to give it. Finally. He gets attack, doesn't get the kill. Although here there he you is, go. Ah, Poppy can't escape as everybody's shooting at him, coming out of Fuka, and so the squad storms over on the side of B. They might just make enough noise to distract from Chihuahua. Ain't happening. Two versus four brings them, you know, a safe spike. Basically, I don't see this being retake that easy at the same time we're still talking about takas we're still talking about bds we've proven again and again that they're a force to be reckoned with in the meantime their map even around the entire match ain't happening another one no self for nip and 40 more seconds are not making it any easier with no control they just lose every duel one after another korea finally shows a sign of life but still i need it you will Taka is an issue, man. Taka is... There's the ult. There's the ult. Taka's the issue! Just mention it! Gets the third! It seems like the French airlines are coming in, and, well, he took it. That means... Such a beautiful the push from A short. That was very important because when he was tagged, he can't really help his teammate. Now oh, Takas goes on go. the side and dies. Finally starts off. Kreia's on the triple. Man's looking for the ace. And that would be that kind of sign of life. As I talk about it, it's still Rodan alive. It is a dangerous, an extremely dangerous one versus two. No more darts. 20 more seconds for that. That's not going to work out time-wise. And as Ryan might be just losing his hat anytime soon, here comes the drop. He wants the one versus one. Takas holding that angle. Oh, oh beautiful gets stuff. that spray. Yeah, very eager from Korea, wasn't it? And unfortunate timing for him. Takas also taking a very proper angle on it. And so, so you see right now, Kildred waiting back there in mid. Sees that. Just had to wait a little until he gets any kind of vision over it. And uh, they all hunt him. They all hunt. Ooh, Takas yeah, for some. Went for that. Obscuring vision. But without any assistance, this is the thing that surprised me. There, there's nothing really that would like, for example, slow him. Slow the guy down there's so he's standing. absolutely bad in movement, but that ain't happening. JD now concussed and double digits on the French side. That might just happen indeed. As he's still healing himself up, that 1v5, that must be... No, I feel like maybe Akuma should have just stand that corner. Maybe just fake that he was next to the fountain. But oh, JD, what HP. HP. That's crazy. He will be at 61 pretty soon, but now they know him, they made him, and they catch, did catch him in an awkward spot when he was trying to get out of it. Now they have lamp control, they don't have a crossfire yet, but that's the crossfire, that's Rodan with the peak, but he knows about, doesn't know about the second guy and he dies. Uh, and that means Tak is on his own, obliterates the first, no more haircut for Kriya, out of the world he is. Kukos is making the long way around, Showstopper would be there, quite sure he does need that. Same time, that angle he has. One flick by the book is gonna make it. <gasps> the mates try. have played pretty much every challenger so far, have been attending most of the VCT events. Still, they're not there where they want to be and where they should be. And that Killjoy ult is not making it easier. Trying to find frags to our detained. Don't oh. knife him. Don't go for that disrespect. You don't need to slice up Korea. There's no need to do that as well. Chihuahua. Right, that, that's a big thing. Um, it, it's actually kind of funny because the shows it, the run started with a showstopper that didn't kill uh, a Kukos. He was left at 12 HP. I feel like that that round 
would have been absolutely gone if Akukas would have died. Freya with Zastra abilities is a big help. JD is still sandwiched. In the meantime, that's not helping him too much. And poor Kriya is moving away. That spike is hitting the ground under any circumstance. And even though BDS don't have any ults, our man down, they're back in the game. They equal it. Could be more to come. Kriya tries to pre-fire. Fails though against Akuma. And his counterpart is making it look so easy for Team BDS. As Rhyme still strikes. First headshot granted. Akuka's all on his own. A double that now needs to be brought in by the IGL. NIP, it is their time to get at least close to Iceland. But this is their time to possibly fail. This is their time to actually fall short. Will they do so? So, yes, they do.